Hey what's up there guys, I'm just watching this video back after I've done this commentary and I see it's kind of long but please like watch the whole video because I promise you this double MOEB is pretty amazing and also I need to, I have a lot of important stuff I need to tell you guys so if you're a loyal subscriber or a, r a really good person like please like stick with me watch the whole video and listen to what I have to say so yes. Hey what's up there guys, it's the money out of COD here. And today I have for you guys a double MOAB. Yes, I said it. A double MOAB. Two MOABs and one game. Yes, it is headquarters, so it is like 15 minutes long. Uh, so yeah, this video is only 10 minutes, so uh, I hope you guys like appreciate all the editing I had to do for this video. It's like trim it down to at least like 10 minutes. So yeah, this is actually my friend's gameplay, it's not mine, and some people will probably say, oh, you're using your friend's gameplay, you can't get a double MOAB, but that is where you're wrong there, because today I got a double MOAB, and, for, and probably the only reason I got it is because for some reason today I'm just like really calm, like, I got like four MOABs today, like double MOAB and then two single ones. And like, I was just like calm, usually my hands are sweating, and I get scared and I just like sit back and camp too much. Well not like usually, but like when I'm close to MOAB, I always sit back, I'm too scared to rush in anywhere. And my hands get all sweaty, so I'm like not confident whatsoever. But I mean, that, that game, this game where I just got a double MOAB today, I mean I was cool, calm, and collective. And I actually got it with seconds to spare. It's pretty amazing. I will post that when I have a thousand subscribers. So if you want to see another better double MOEB, I'm not saying this is bad, but this is a pretty good double MOEB. But the one I got was probably 8 minutes and 66 domination. And I would have had over 70 kills in a 66 regular domination. But I the MOE the second MOEB I called in didn't actually kill anyone. I just got to call it in. So yeah. All right. So uh, now what I want to talk to you guys today about. First off, I want to thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, and thank you guys again for getting me 400 subscribers. I started this YouTube channel like January 1st, December like 31st, and it is now February 22nd. So that's about. A month and a half. So in a month of a ha a month and a half, I have gained over 400 subscribers, and that that's pretty good. I mean, the more subscribers, the more people that are gonna like, the more like my channel is gonna get out there. The more people might share my channel or share my videos. So I mean, I'm I'm just growing, and I also got partnered with TGN. I mean, most of you guys probably know that if you see my like amazing like background and channel with all the cool stuff and all <laughs> so yeah i hope to have maybe 500 by end of february maybe because i mean it's double moeb should get some publicity because it is a double moeb and it's not using that little glitch thing where you get like one moeb and then like a few kills later you get another one because something having to do with like hardline pro no it's two moeb streaks uh, but yeah, besides the 400 subs, uh, thank you guys again for subscribing and getting me 400 subs. I want to talk to you guys about a few other topics. Uh, the first one is I need an editor for my javelin montage. I have 10 javelin clips that I put together when Drop Zone first came out. Me and my friends, we just took javelins and we went to work. I mean, it, it was it was probably one of the funnest times I've ever had. And I don't know, no, maybe not ever in Call of Duty. It's probably my funnest time, one of my fun, uh, funnest, if that is a word, uh, times I've ever had Model for three. Because I mean, we just take javelins, we just aim at the drop zone, we just let it go, quads, triples, five mans. Don't, not, not sure if I got a six man or not. You'll have to wait and see for the montage. But if you are an editor. This is only for the editors now who are like edit montages. If you guys do not know what I'm expecting from an editor, oh here's the first MOEB. What I'm expecting from an editor. Basically just go to my last video where that uh where my friend Olman Nation 
he uh I post his uh, uh sniper montage. Basically, I want editing like that, but with javelins, like slow motion javelins comes down and just I don't know. I just like I just want really good editing like that. And you can put your name like edited by blah 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 and like the beginning intro. Try not to make the intro too long because uh, his sniper montage intro was like 50 seconds. I mean, it was like re really good, really nice. Don't get me wrong, but don't want it to be like too long because I have like 10 clips. Probably like 20 seconds each, so I don't want it to be too long. But yeah, uh, I don't want it to be over like 5-6 minutes, so try to keep it at that. Uh, and basically, this is kind of like an editing uh, contest. That's basically what it is. So... If you want to enter or try your best to try to edit my montage, then uh, just send me a message. Be like, hey man, can you send me those clips? I really want to edit your montage. And I'll say sure and send you guys the links because I already have them downloaded. His elimination, he was supposed to edit them for me. But I don't know if he's on vacation or something because he hasn't responded to me. So yeah, I need an editor. If you're an editor, just send me a message. And I'll send you clips and hopefully you can win and get some publicity. So the next time, uh, the next thing I want to talk to you guys about, and yes, I am reading this off the list because, um, yeah, man, I, I mean, I don't want to like sit in the middle and like be like, uh, uh, I mean, I, I write stuff down, need to organize, need to make sure I'm prepared for my commentary so I don't stumble and I'm just like giving you guys great information the whole time. So, uh, the next thing I want to talk to you guys about is what do you guys think about putting music on my videos? Because, um, see, see, yeah, yeah, right, right there, my bad. But, yeah, if you guys do not know the man in black, like, I guess, like, check him out. Basically, what he does is he doesn't really, he's not a really good commentator, or he doesn't really like to commentate. So what he does is he just puts like music on his uh, gameplays and yeah, doesn't really commentate. I mean, I don't really watch most of his or some of his videos because of that unless they're like really good. But I mean, every now and then, I mean, I might like be busy or something so I don't have time to put up a commentary. So I might like just put music over one of my gameplays. But see, the thing is, some people probably won't like my music and I don't like I mean, I, I don't really care for the music like usually people put on videos like Queens or none of that old stuff or it's the final countdown or what it not. I, I, I like to, I mean, like, don't get me wrong, like, here, but I like to listen to, like, hip-hop, like, kind of rap, like, kind of that, but I wouldn't make it, like, too ghetto, like, I, I'd, I'd probably make, like, a, like, like the motto, like, the, that's a song, like, even white people sing or uh yeah you might feel like rapper sing so i mean it would be like stuff like that not like hood shit banging hoes and stuff like that so it won't be like that so let me know what you guys think about that in the comments below and next thing i want to talk to you guys about is uh if you guys subscribe from the mighty god of cod uh i told you guys a while ago that i like uh recorded a commentary and gameplay while I was playing Call of Duty, while I was high, <laughs> I, I don't want to say that too loud because my parents are downstairs, but uh, yeah, I did, and I have it on my computer, and I never posted it, so I mean, I'm gonna post that on the Mighty God of COD, put in like a series of like 10 different videos because it's like an hour and 40 minutes. So, yeah, uh, make sure you, if you unsubscribe to Mighty God of COD, you might want to like subscribe it to it back or like just check it out. Because I'll probably be posting that commentary like in a week or two. So be on the lookout for that on the Mighty God of Cod, my other channel. The one that started, no, actually it was my second ever channel on YouTube. So yeah, and another thing I want to talk to you guys about is real life videos. Uh, I posted my friend Steven, almost. If you guys watched the video, you probably should have stalked him on Facebook. <laughs> uh, inside joke. But yeah, I posted a video of him doing the cinnamon challenge. That was like a real life video. And that, that got a pretty good response. I mean, you guys like like that. I mean, I, I thought it was pretty funny. Some people thought it was funny. And uh, so yeah, I'll be posting another video of that. Unless you guys say something like. Let, let me know in the comments below about that too. Like, maybe you'll probably be writing a whole paragraph in the comments. But uh, 
Let me know if you guys are cool with me posting real life videos. We did a prank call to pizza, not pizza, uh, Papa John's, and it was pretty funny. Pretty sure you guys will enjoy it, so I just want to make sure it's okay with you guys. And last thing is, uh, right there, second and be. I want to know when you guys watch my videos because, like, what day of the week, what time, because I don't really know, like, when to post this. I want to make sure when I post stuff, everyone gets to see it. So, make sure in the comments below, make sure it's Eastern Time, United States, and peace. I'm out, guys.